お前を殺す。Hey, we're back in another video. We're from you continuing the casting of Frank Stone. If you're new, subscribe to your boy. Alright, let's look around real quick. Look around while waiting for a storekeeper. Alright, bet. What's this? Uh. Yeah, I'm not reading all that. Y'all can read that, though. Okay, okay. Alright. Let's see what I can find. Oh, hold on. What the frick is this? Crow. Oh, wait, hold on. What's back here? Uh, all right. Nah, man, I don't, I don't mess with mannequins. I do not mess with these mannequins over here. Oh, what's this? I don't like that shit. Put that down. Y'all better not move. Y'all better not move. Not move right now. Alright, turn it on real quick. Who would want to watch this creep fest? Hey, I don't know. But that ain't really in my business. I'm gonna go on. Alright, hold on. Wait, let me look over here real quick. Oh, got some film. Never mind. Don't get it. Hello? What the fuck? They're trapper. Cuddling up to that at night. Okay, I know that from Dead by Daylight. Alright. Yo, Linda! She comes running out straight at us with a giant chainsaw, and you're like so bummed out. What do you mean? You're in luck. A very fine item indeed. Uh, okay. Yes. I'm gonna no. $20? Bet. May I? I insist. Hey, okay. 20, 20 buckaroos. It's pretty old. Possible we could make it work, but it's not exactly what we had in mind. Mm -hmm. What? Uh, how no. much are you asking for it? She's gonna uh, up the price. A tiny little price tag on it, but I seem to have forgotten my reading glasses. Why don't you take a look? Uh, how much money have you got? How much is that? 20 okay. Bucks. 20? That seemed reasonable. It feels a little high. That seemed reasonable. She's giving you a freaking camera. Okay. Sure. I think that seems reasonable for something like this. Yo, yeah, thanks. Thank you very much. Thanks for finding us a camera. Oh. It was no trouble at all. Hey. It truly is such a joy to see young people so passionate about the arts. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's us. Yep, I'm out. Uh. Ah, uh, she look creepy. Wait, guys. Oh, I'm such a moron. I, I told my mom I'd pick up some milk on the way home. Oh, do you want me to... Hold this. Be right back. Oh, all right. Hey, Chris, we just spent all the money. Emergency sock quarter. Emergency sock quarter? Sock quarter. Oh. I grab this milk. Oh. The fuck is that? Let's get, let's get, let's get the milk and leave. Oh, all right. I'm, a, I'm a that milk is. Another missing kid. Damn, that crazy. I hope they're found. 
Hey. Yo. Me. Robert. Hey, Chris. Robert. Black people. Yes, yeah, so I heard. To the library. How would you know? Don't think I ever saw you come in. I got spies everywhere, man. So, Linda. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can always come in yourself, you know. Books don't bite. Uh, Linda's the bookworm. Mm. I'm more of a movie worm. Mm, I don't think that's a real kind of worm. Neither's a bookworm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ah, so we're about to close in like two minutes, so. Oh, right, yeah. Ring me up. Yo, Fez, let me get that mail real quick. All right, that'll be 25 cents. Okay. 25 cents for a carton of milk? God. <laughs> yeah, you sure don't see coin like this working in the library. Actually, you don't see any coin. <laughs> it's volunteer <laughs> hours. Not so bad if you like to read, I guess. Uh, mm, true. We've got a rad horror section, too. Didn't know you were a horror guy. Just books? Movies, comics, too. Whatever I can get my hands on. You know, mm, okay. Jaime and Linda and I are all making a horror movie. Down at the old Cedar Steel Mill. No kidding. We could always use an extra hand if you're into that kind of thing. Uh, super into it. Hey. Uh, uh, Does my dad know you're going into the mill? He like, who's your dad? A place like a hawk. Oh, your dad. We had your a little run-in with him today, but we're gonna sneak back in to uh, shoot the rest. Uh, what? Man. I would love to be involved. Involved in what? Ooh, hey, Sam! My boy yeah, Sam! Uh, he was just telling me about a, um, a... We're putting together... My boy Sam! To show movies at the library. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. You need a ride home? Oh, yeah. Uh, let me just get my bag. Hey, hi, right, Sam. What's up with you, my boy? Chris. I'm sorry I was a little harsh with you and your friends before. Okay, you cool. Just wanted to make sure you're taking me seriously. Okay. Uh, we're still gonna finish the movie. They told us to tell me about. I mean, I'm cool with it. Like, I'm chilling. I get it. They told me about Frank Stone. Gotta be a lot of demons in a place like that. When you spend enough time in my line of work. You realize every place has got its demons. Apex. You ready? Take care. All right, Sam. Appreciate it, my boy. Hey, hey, hey. I can get you back into the mill without him knowing. Ah. Uh, word. Let's make a movie. <laughs> bro, why you? Oh, you, you must have. You, I have worn many masks over the centuries. Oh. Dr. Augustine Lieber was renowned, professional, and trusted. Frank Stone confided in me. What the hell? Allowed me to unlock his potential okay. during those dark days in the psychiatric ward. Uh. And now, a new guise. A new timeline. Uh. A new chance. Giving them the camera, I admit, was unfair, even for me. What they the? couldn't know what power they held in their hands, nor what cruelty awaits them in the steel mill. Mm. But what true creator wouldn't suffer for their art? Okay. 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 These walls have eyes. Okay. Okay. When 
Linda. Wait, that's Linda? Wait, hold on. Are you okay? Linda. Uh, yeah. Guess I just dozed off a bit. Wait, what happened to Augustine again? She left. L left? She said she had to do something very urgently in her private reliquary. Hey, reliquary. Again, can we forget about Augustine for a minute and talk about the a thousand foot long elephant in the room? What? How's, oh. A thousand feet is the average length of film in a movie? Oh. Mm. Guess we were all playing it close to the best before. Huh. It's not my film. I, I didn't, I just worked on it. Didn't direct it. Okay. It's not even on my official filmography. I meant how we were all holding back about our film strips. Oh, right. Uh, yeah. Whether you take credit for it or not, it's definitely the most infamous project that's uh, associated with you. Cursed film collectors have been unsuccessfully searching for any trace of it for years. And now we are all here, each with our own little slice of a mysterious pie. It's a pretty mm. big deal. So, all of our film strips, they're part of this movie you and your friends made, Linda? If they're not fakes. Oh. Yeah. Mine's not fake. And all that stuff you said about it being cursed? Murderous rages, CIA interrogation, total disassociation with reality. Because it's so rare, only a few people know for sure. So is If Augustine mm. wants the only known surviving pieces of it, <laughs> she's gonna have to pay up. Why do you think she wants it so bad? I mean, it's not really cursed, right? I prefer not to dwell on the past. We're here, someone's offering to buy our sections of the film. That is all I'm concerned with right now. Providence mm. goes a long way towards a successful sale. So do motives. I don't know about you, but I would very much like to know why Augustine is so desperate to get her hands on this film. Right. Well. First rule of business is to gather every bit of intel you can on your opponent. And I don't know about you two ladies, but I have been itching to get a little look-see around this big old house of curiosities. Are we allowed to look around? Mm. What do you say, Director? Want to keep sitting around, or want to peek behind the curtain? Uh, not really my business. Yeah, I'm, I might. I might. It's not really my business, bro. I think I'm good here. Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm okay. You're lost. Yeah, I'm on my business. You die alone. Oh, all right, man. Talk to Maddie. So, uh, murder mill? Oh. Do you really think Augustine might be up to something? Like, do you Hell think yeah. she isn't going to follow through on her... Uh, Offers. No. It seems to be good to be true. Don't keep... mm, cynical. Don't give your hopes up. It seems to be good to be true. I mean, I don't know her too well. Uh, uh, I don't. I don't know her too well. Not gonna lie, I don't know her. Never trust an offer until the money's in the bank, figuratively speaking. Especially if it seems too good to be true. Come on, not everyone's trying to outmaneuver everyone else all the time. They are in my business. Well, show business is not real life. Real life is overrated. Maybe, but Wait, it's the only life I got. Oh. Only if you believe that. Fall off the stand? I don't know, bro. I don't. Fuck do you want, Stan? Why don't we go look around together? Unless you want to stay here by yourself. Okay. I bet got you. Got you, Maddie. Oh, never thought your little Maddie bear would end up in a place like this, huh? That? Hmm? Oh, nothing. Never mind. What were you shouting about? Mm. Look at this place. What? Movies here. What? Cause it's cool as hell. 
I don't. I'm not really digging the vibe. Take a look around. I'm not digging the vibe right now. Deny this place would make an incredible film location. What the hell? All right, we going upstairs. I love your outfit, hmm. by the way. Well, thanks. It's Italian. Well, the shoes are Italian, and a belt. I got a cheat from a guy. He's got a guy who's got a pants guy. So oh. I got these pants from his guy's guy. Had him tape uh, just uh, Okay. Uh, uh, also, damn, there's too many guys. Ah, uh, yes. Let's check out the other floors. Good thinking. Wait. Hold on a second. Hmm. What? Before all this goes any further, I need to know how both of you got your pieces of the film. Um, well, it's no secret, really. Um, after my mom died a few months ago, I found it when I was going through her stuff. Maddie, what was your mom's name? Both, or was it Bonnie Rivera? Oh? Yeah, it... How did you know that? Bonnie Rivera. You look just like her. Bonnie! A long time ago. A whole other lifetime. Oh. He was one of my closest friends. Uh, oh, I okay. I never met him. I hadn't heard that Bonnie had passed. Yeah, it was pretty sudden. Oh. Wow. Maddie, that's... It's quite sad. Stay here. Are you touching? What? Don't do that. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna there. I'm so sorry you had to go through that. It's never easy to lose someone you love. Thanks. Mm. Lucky for me, it wasn't my first rodeo. <sighs> okay. Bonnie, I wish I'd stayed in touch with her. <clears throat> Weren't you wondering where both of our film strips came from? Okay, how about you? I don't suppose you'd like to enlighten me. Of course. And? Well, I can't just tell you for free, can I? Stay in. information is very valuable. You a bitch. What's your price? You know what? I'm gonna have to get back to you on that. Okay, bro. This this nigga Stan. Hey, man, bro. Just tell me your damn how you get the damn film strip. Move, Maddie. Hey, Stan. Stan. Oh, hold on. Cool statue. Oh. Missing a piece though. Wait a minute. Well, they got a large bird cage. Powerful resemblance in Augustine's family. That or Augustine loves cosplay. Uh, what's this? The face of evil, the true story trash. of Frank Stone. Sam Green took down Frank Stone. I could write a better book than this. Hmm. Yeah, my ring on that. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna reel that. There you go. Alright. Whoa. Quite a piece. Look at the metalwork. It's beautiful. Hmm. Okay, it might be like a little puzzle. I'm gonna go up more, more stairs. Yeah? What would you do if it was you here instead of me? Hey, hold on. No way. You'd be climbing the walls looking for a way out. Oh. Uh... Stan? Psh, not in a million years. No way. You'd really get a kick out of this place. Hmm. And then you'd probably kick me out of this place and keep it all to yourself. Right. Talking to someone special? 
What? I, um, <laughs> what do you mean? Like, Bonnie? Perhaps? I was mm. in Berlin, you know, at school, when I heard she was sick. But it was my midterms, and she said I should just come home when I finished. So I did. But by then it was too late. Damn. She died while I was over the Atlantic. It all happened so fast, it doesn't feel like she's gone. So I just kind of pretend like she isn't. Yeah, by having demons she in your face. She was a talker. <laughs> yeah, she was. Hey, look at this. This was just last summer. Dang. I know you said it had been a really long time, but can you tell me anything about her from when you knew her? Ah, uh, gosh. Well, she was the most intimidating girl I've ever met. Even after I got oh. to know her. She did everything she wanted to do, and nobody could stop her. <laughs> and that sounds like mom. Any good stories? Uh, gotta reminisce. It's not a good idea to dwell in the past. There's something I never told anyone. You know what? Let's dwell. Let's, let's dwell. Why not? Let's dwell on the past. Yeah, there is something I've been thinking about. I've never told anyone else. It was a long time ago. We were just kids making a movie. Jaime, Chris, and me. Oh. Everything's still so fuzzy about what happened, but there's one thing that always just stuck in my mind. Clear as a bell. That night. We were on our way home from picking up a new camera. Oh. We were driving past the Rivera's house. The garage door was wide open, full of light. And the craziest fucking sound you ever mm. heard was just tearing out of there in every direction. And right in the middle of it all was Bonnie. I, I don't think I've ever seen anyone so completely in tune with themselves. The only thing that mattered was that moment. Nothing else. That was your mom. Hey. W. Bonnie. Thank you. Hey guys. What? Look. What? Dad, I don't see anything. Ah, there, right there. Nigga. Oh God, there's someone out there. Oh hell no. There might be a be at the tune strip. If this plot gets any thicker. No, I'm very concerned about the shit. If someone else did find out this deal is going down, they might be after the film strips. Well, healthy competition does make for better offers. My guess is that if they're all dressed in black and prowling around the place like a thief, they're not here to make an offer. Maybe they just want to make a dramatic entrance. Should we tell Nigga. Augustine? They might be dangerous. Even yeah. if you wanted to tell her, good luck finding her. She said she was going to her private reliquary. That's a place for artifacts, right? There's artifacts all over the place. Right. Mm -hmm. So, if you were gonna have a private place for extra special, extra valuable artifacts, maybe you'd put them behind a door like that. Yeah. You've got a point. Yeah. Get Open that door. door. Nigga, Dad, knock. You can get through that, including sound. Which means it might be the safest place to be, whether Augustine's in there or not. Yep. I feel like we should okay. be in there. Who that? Nah, who that? Nah, who the hell is that?
Venom of Cedar Steel. What's taking them so long? I thought we were gonna have a production meeting before we shoot. The van's already all loaded up. Mm. I read an article that said girls don't like it when guys get all twisted up about their punctuality. Okay, this is a little Linda. What? Why did you need an article to tell you that? Mm. I just thought you might find that information useful. I'm not trying to control Chris. Just got a lot to do. Mm hmm. Uh. Hey. Let's go. Hey, right out time. Time to get cooking. What? Nothing, nothing. Just trying to keep a low profile. Bonnie snooping around. What you... Right. Bonnie cool. Is everybody ready to get this production meeting started? We got a big night ahead of us. Guys, I, I gotta tell you, my mind's going like a million miles an hour right now. Did you know you can get like every newspaper article ever written at the library? It's insane. Really? It's all right there. No, tell me more. I've spent can, like all really? day looking up every single thing I could find about Frank Stone, the mill, the murders. We are sitting on a freaking gold mine here. Sounds like a productive mm. day. I can't take all the credit. I had a little help from my uh, assistant. <sighs> it was nothing. Hey, modesty free zone. I think I would have mm. given up about eight dozen times if this guy hadn't been there to cheer me on. Just do hey. my job. Hey, W. Robert. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. You feel insecure you about Chris and Robert? Uh, okay, bro. Gotta wear the team jersey. Yo, Jaime, why you why you insecure? Oh, this don't is... be don't don't be mad. This is amazing. I'm I'm honored. You wanna wear the stripes? You gotta earn the rights. No, you mean, I promise I'll be the best ancillary producer you've ever seen. <laughs> Production assistant. Yeah, yeah, totally. <laughs> Feast your eyes. Uh. Whoa. Wait, where's Sheriff Cream? Ah, uh, yeah, so. Dad's never exactly been stoked about that. But I thought he got the guy. Yeah. And Sheriff Kushik took all the credit. People around here knew what was up, but... Let me see that. Mm. This one's a 10-year retrospective. They go into all sorts of grisly details left out of the press the first time around. And Dad got a little more credit, too. This is big deal stuff. We're making our movie in the very same spot it went down. Can't beat that. Uh, stone victim were real people. I guess not. Guess not. It's definitely yeah. not something you see every day. That's yeah, what go I'm with counting it. on. Wait, so shouldn't we head out? Yes, right. So slight change of plans. What? When Robert and I dug into all these articles, we realized there might be an opportunity to find some places in the mill that could be even more directly connected to stone. Where we can shoot. So mm. it'll just take us a few minutes to look through. That's not gonna leave us a lot of time. Trust me, it'll be worth it. Especially if this is our only chance to go back to the mill. Uh okay. Hey, I say let it do it do their thing. Alright, let me see. Our list sure can't get enough Frank Stone. Secret of secrets of killer stone come to a come to light. Hmm, September 16th. Here, why don't you start with these? So we're looking for Frank Stone references. We're looking so for no one anything was sad to referencing see it go. specific locations hmm. in the mill that could be associated with Frank Stone. The mill's okay. a pretty huge place. I wonder if Linda's okay with all this Frank Stone yet. stuff. Tom Holt really interview. Possible. We'll find it. Tom Holt. The freak is Tom Holt. Yo, Linda. Murder mill. Oh, Here, look at this. Look at this. Mill projections dire for fall season. It mentions Frank? No, but it goes into the mindset of no, the workers. That's cool. It's People cool. were depressed. There were suicides. At the mill. I didn't want to say anything, but I'm just not a fan of this. Oh. Mm. Uh. Understandable. 
She's like, yeah. Her obsession with Frank Stone is intense. Should I be worried about Robert? I feel like I feel like you just mind your business and just just do the just do the shoot. Her whole obsession with Frank Stone and the murders just feels a little intense. Maybe it's because she's not from Cedar Hills, but you know, mm. those victims could have been any of us or our families. But they weren't. So you don't think it matters either. I didn't say it didn't matter. I, yeah, well. It a long time ago. And Chris is excited because some of the locations could work really well for the film. Like this one. Take a look. What is all this? I came up with a new scene to shoot. That she wrote? Yeah. Does Chris? I told Chris about it last night. Oh, she was into it? Yeah, we'll shoot it if we have time. Cool. Mm, okay. This furnace chamber location is perfect. But I wouldn't have known about it without Chris's research. Okay, I'll get bet. It's pretty rough. Hope we have time to shoot it. It's very supportive of you. Thanks, Robert. I mean, Jaime, sorry. Forgot which one of you is the supportive one. That was me. Uh -huh. You're mean. Yes, yes I am. Okay, Linda. Oh, yes! Huh? What is... It's a picture of Frank Stone? Look at the date. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? This is from before the murders, before they realized it was Frank. It's about mill operations, kind of a puff piece to drum up interest in new recruits. Hello, what is this? Look at the caption. Worker Frank Stone, machine shop. Bullseye. Machine shop, huh? We've got to shoot there. Mm. That's... That's the place. It's perfect. So, Ooh. time to go? Okay, oh, yeah. people, company move. Time to head on out and shoot the shit out of this thing. Let's go, let's go. Time is money. Let's make a movie. Red light, unhand me. Bonnie. Hmm. Now, what were you little ding dongs working on? Hello. Interesting. Ladies and gentlemen, I present the mill. Yep. Uh, there it is. I, yeah, I don't. You see the creek down there? I ain't trying to Follow get involved. Right to the secret entrance. I don't see it. That's why it's secret. Someone look at us. <sighs> we don't have to do this. Yes, we do. Hey. Ready? Oh, careful. First step's a doozy. The first step to doozy. All right. This way. Yeah, come on, honey. Alright, you know, I'm gonna end this episode here. If you're new, subscribe to your boy. I'll see y'all.